I've been passionate about playing and teaching slap bass for over three decades. And over the next two minutes, I'd love to help you get your slap bass playing up to speed. If it sounds good, it is good. So you've perfected the slap, you've mastered the pull, bagged the left hand slap, and started working on a slap lick such as this. But it just feels like you're never gonna get it all up to speed. Am I right? The first thing you need to do is slow it down. Yes. Slow it down. By the way, do check out my slap basics videos if you've yet to learn the basic techniques. The link is on the screen now. It's also in the description below the video. Let's say you're working on this link. In order to play it at that tempo, we need to properly program it into our muscle memory, which is only possible at slow tempos. Be sure to download the worksheet and tab for this lick using the link on the screen. It's also in the description below. Starting at 50 BPM or slower allows us to focus on timing, economy of motion, accuracy, and evenness of volume and tone. Refer to the PDF for more details on each of these aspects. Repetition is key. Set a timer for five minutes and keep going until the time's up. Take rest if needed to avoid injury, but otherwise keep going. Only when 100% comfortable should you take a break, increase the tempo by five to 10 BPM, then do it all again. Repeat this process until you start making mistakes. Write the tempo down and use this as your target next time you practice. Be sure to start from 50 BPM or slower each and every practice session. Be honest with yourself and resist the urge to rush through as this simply doesn't work. I've seen it time and time again during my years as a tutor. On the flip side, I've witnessed incredible progress in just a few hours by sticking rigidly to the program. I'd love to know if this is a process you've heard of before. Perhaps you're already using it. Do let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.